Welcome to Buzz Around the Globe. Humans have pumped so much water out of the ground that it has effectively affected Earth's spin, and the pole has drifted at a speed of 4.36 cm per year between 1993 and 2010. This has led to Earth being tilted nearly 80 cm eastward, scientists have estimated based on new climate models. The study published in the Geophysical Research Letters states that an important anthropogenic contribution is sea level rise due to groundwater depletion resulting from irrigation. Earth's pole has drifted towards 64.16 degrees east at a speed of 4.36 cm per year during 1993 to 2010 due to groundwater depletion and resulting sea level rise, the paper read. The international team of researchers estimated that humans have pumped out 2,150 gigatons of groundwater, equivalent to more than 0.24 inches of sea level rise, though they acknowledge that estimating the exact figure is difficult. As water moves around on Earth, it can cause slight changes in how our planet spins. We show that the model estimate of water redistribution from aquifers to the oceans would result in a drift of Earth's rotational pole, about 78.48 cm towards 64.16 degrees east, the paper read. Earth's rotational pole actually changes a lot. Our study shows that among climate-related causes, the redistribution of groundwater actually has the largest impact on the drift of the rotational pole. Ki Wan Sio, a geophysicist at Seoul National University who led the study, said in a statement released by the American Geophysical Union. Researchers maintained that the location of the aquifers, groundwater, also matters for Earth's spin to change. The team estimated that during the period of the study, most water was redistributed in western North America and northwestern India. While the slight drifting of the pole will not have an impact on the seasons, researchers cautioned that over a longer geologic time period, it could have an impact on the climate. Do tell us what you think about this video in the comments section, and for more news updates subscribe to India Today.